we beat Man City twice uh, last season and many times before that as well. We, we were unbeaten against Liverpool. But the teams that are very defensive, mm -hmm. like the Brightons, the Burnleys, the Brentfords, you notice we dominate those games and those guys come in the last five or ten minutes, counter attack and score a goal against us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we need to be very uh, strategic in, in determining our starting lineup for those games and also in terms of substitutions. You know, it all depends where the game is. Uh, Tanga and Dumbele. All right, I know he's classified as lazy. Yeah. Right, but I always, my, the, the guys uh, don't like me saying this, but I call it lazy elegance. That's his style, and he's a very talented player. Yeah. Hugely gifted. Right, if managed properly, he can have a major impact. At, yeah, uh, I remember you did say last year that you, you you need that creativity, especially when players against the small teams yeah, yeah, who, yeah. Ap who apply a small like defensive sort of what you call it a, um, a low defensive block. That's and it. if you want to break and unlock those defenses, you need his uh, intelligence and, and uh, intelligence and his creativity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In those instances, so yeah, very interesting. Right. So we've spoken and spoken. Mike <laughs> Chambers, <laughs> do you have anything to say about Spurs? The game is about glory. Well. You know what I do have to say is that mm -hmm. Spurs uh, buy a port a lot this year. Yeah. And I think it was two or three years ago they bought nothing. Yeah, I remember. They had a I season remember. where they, they bought nothing. Mm -hmm. And buying nothing kept them down, kept them back. It didn't, didn't help them in that season. They started to come through when they, when they got the coach last year. And I have a slight concern for what's happening in my own team <laughs> Liverpool. With, with the limited number of transfers they've made this year. They've made one, really, really, and they've lost Mane, so it's kind of in and out. But there doesn't seem to be a lot of strategic buying going on, unless he thinks he's going to do it through the season, during the season. Um, and I think, as Marion said last week, there are a few Liverpool players who are getting a bit of a you know, uh, been around a while. And we need to be careful. Uh, there's a lot of excitement. However, that having been said, the team is a very strong, well balanced team that has heaps of experience. A lot of new players came in last year and they begin to show their way. So uh, I think it's going to be very interesting uh, to see how it pans out, especially with all the changes around. Changes going on at Man United, changes going on at Spurs.